I would like to see what Windows 8 is like. Windows 8 download I really want. Okay. Uh, consumer preview. That seems like a good deal. And I am going to download it. In fact, I've already done this. United States. There we go. Okay, and now let's download it. Okay, I would like to use it. I will preview the ISO format. Okay, and I want 32 bits because I can only use the 32 bit version inside my virtual manager so it's a 2.5 gigabyte and it says it's going to take 26 minutes so we will come back to it when we're done and now I am going to load Windows 8 for fun And I think I'm going to give it four gigs. And we will go to my 64 gigs. Okay display is 128 megabytes let's see if it's what choice does it does it have any other choices oh well we will give it the full 256 megabytes that it can have and the storage let's select this let's select this and let's choose something it's Linux downloads okay now we start it and this is the first time I'm having a look at Windows 8 interesting and let's bring it into here as we and there we are K G seven J Okay, yes, I can accept it because Okay, since this is a virgin system, I decided to do the custom install. Okay, in order to use the Windows 8 consumer preview, you need a 1 gigahertz or faster CPU, 1 gigabytes of memory for a 32 bits, 16 gigabytes of disk space, uh, Microsoft Direct X graphics device additional in order to use touch you need a tablet or a monitor that supports multi-touch to access Windows Store and to 
download and run apps you need an active internet connection and a screen resolution of at least 1024768 are there risks to installing windows 8 preview yes the consumer preview is stable has been thoroughly tested but it's not finished the finished product your pc could crash and that's why it's good to use a virtual manager so if it crashes who cares you should back up your data etc again it's a very good reason why you want to use virtualization to test a new software like Windows 8. The interesting thing is, at this stage, ah, for a while I got scared because it had just gone totally black. So now we know. If it goes totally black, like now, it is not dead. Okay, let's give it a name pick any color you want i'll be able to personalize it later this seems like a good pc name consumer express settings i do have another account but I don't want to use that okay again it's gone dark okay welcome thank you the interesting thing is that I don't have a Windows uh, phone I do have both Android and of course iPhones and iPads and Macintoshes and real computers again by having a virtual machine you can run real computers i.e. Linux on top of and inside your Windows okay we seem to be there so let's just for fun go into Internet Explorer and it's interesting 